What's up guys, Jack here and in today's video I'm going to show you a tasty Team of the Season hybrid squad builder featuring Team of the Season Martinez and Team of the Season De Rossi as well as second in form Benascia. This team played so well for me, it's a very solid team and as far as Team of the Season teams go, it's not that expensive either. It's, pretty, it's fairly cheap for a Team of the Season team if you get what I'm trying to say. Uh, the formation I use is a 4-1-2-1-2, again it's my favourite formation on this FIFA so I'm always going to try and use it as much as possible. But before we get into the team guys, if you need to buy some Ultimate Team Coins, make sure you go over to onefifa.com they are a cheap and reliable service and you get, get an extra 5% off with my discount code Ezekiel G. So kicking off this team in gold we have Buffon, not the inform one, just the normal one. I don't really think uh, his inform is a big enough difference really between you know between the two to go for it but he only costs 1,800 coins and he is an 86 rated goalkeeper but as far as his uh, in-game stats go they're pretty standard and he's a very good goalkeeper. Moving into the centre backs First centre back position we have on the right side we have that second in form Benascia for 59,000 coins and for an in form of such high quality 91 defending 88 heading and 75 pace this guy is a real bargain I recommend him highly to get in this team again if you want to just get a normal one it's absolutely fine it's still a beast uh, but in game wise this card has 91 strength 92 aggression 95 interceptions 95 standing tackle 95 marking and 90 heading accuracy he also stands at six foot two with 86 jumping so you can imagine how strong this guy is in the air in situations defending you but also on corners going into the op opposition's net um, anyway moving into the uh, second center back we have Chiellini and this time I just went for the normal card since his inform is actually quite expensive and if you compare second inform Benatia to this card there's a or his, you know the other inform card I didn't really see the point of going for the, for the inform Chiellini he's very expensive but this guy cost me only 1900 coins and he has 77 pace 86 defending and 82 heading I've used him plenty of times before so you should know my opinion of him already but now usually I'll go for a left back or a right back but we're going to go straight up to the CDM position where we have a team of the season De Rossi we managed to pick him up for 236,000 coins. Now remember guys, I bought him about 16 hours after he came out in packs, so I did pay quite a bit for him. I think over the next couple of weeks, he will drop in price, maybe to 150k, or maybe even less, who knows. But uh, D-Ross's in-game stats are just incredible. He's an 88 uh, overall. It's nice to see him with more pace as well. He has 89 heading, 88 defending, 86 passing, 83 dribbling, 79 shooting, and 73 passing. All of those stats are just bang on for for, you know what you need in this kind of position in game wise he is he has 94 shot power 90 shot long shots he also has so many green stats it's actually too much to read out but if you want to go and check it out make sure you go over to foothead or footwiz and just check the in-game stats uh, instead of buying the card and having a look yourself anyway moving down to the right back position we have conco but it could be pretty much any Serie A defender you want uh, some people say they prefer a bar tape but i prefer the height the strength and also the work rates of conco so it's really down to you guys i'm not saying buy this guy i'm saying this is what i'll do uh, for my team but in game wise he has 86 pace which is more than enough with 77 defending and 72 heading he also has some surprise stats for a non-red gold such as 79 passing and 79 dribbling so moving into the right mid position i went for quadrado for only 800 coins he has 93 pace four star skill and 87 dribbling uh, this guy is just a monster in that right mid positions i know it seems like a sweaty thing to say as well but he does have 81 crossing which you're probably thinking oh, that's not that high but that's one of his highest stats so he's 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 more of a person that's uh, is right footed as well by the way he runs down the right side cross into uh, well you know team of the season martinez in the squad so yeah that's what i use him for but he's also great at cutting in with those four star skill moves and that insane high dribbling and pace so that's the right side complete let's go down to the defense and go over to the left back we have alex sandro he cost me 750 coins which is his going rate at the moment but that just tells you for a non-rare if they cost that much they're obviously a very very good player um, he also has 82 pace 80 dribbling and 79 defense defending as well as 75 passing uh, moving up to the left mid position we have Varela for 600 coins but you do need to move him from the left wing to the left mid position luckily I already had a card so that's why it only says 600 coins it, it should be around 1500 to about 2000 in this position uh, but in game wise um, he has 84 pace 82 dribbling, 75 shooting as well as 4 star skill and 4 star weak foot so he's a very good player uh, for a non-rare as well 
Uh, but moving up to the striker guys, we have of course Team of the Season Martinez for 2,999,000 9, coins. Currently it's going for about 2752325. That's the kind of bracket I've seen so far since it's been out. And uh, just like De Rossi, he was bought 16 hours after being out, so he probably will go down in price. He might even have changed price by the time you see this video. Uh, so far, I've seen a lot of people say they don't really like Martinez. Uh, he seems a little bit sluggish and stuff, but so far, he's absolutely awesome for me. He has uh, he has five pace increase, eight shooting, uh, six heading upgrades, and in-game he feels like a flipping tank, and I mean a flipping very heavy tank. But some people said he feels sluggish, as I said. Uh, well, he does obviously feel... Exactly like his normal card really, except faster, better, stronger, better finishing and I think people who said they don't really like the feel of him are just using his card wrong. Uh, in game wise he has 98 finishing and 93 shot power, standing at 6 foot tall with 92 jumping and 93 heading accuracy. It's plain to see for me that we have a contender here, one of the best strikers in the game. And if you actually compare his stats to someone like Inform Benteke, he outplays him uh, massively. And uh, people just need to learn how to use him, I think. Uh, myself including, you know, I haven't maximised my potential with him. I needed to play a little bit more uh, with him to get, you know, as best as I can with him. Moving down to the camp position, guys, we have another Colombian player, Quintero, for 700 coins. And for me, he is actually one of the best players in this team. I think he's one of the best non-rare cams I've actually used in the game. He has 75 pace, 84 dribbling, 71 shooting, 74 passing, and 4-star skills. And it's really actually hard to say something like that because his card stats, as you can see, just aren't that outstanding uh, but once you use them in game you'll, you guys will see how good he is now guys moving into the last play of this team you can have pretty much any colombian striker you want including a barbo muriel ramos and uh even falcao and that's the player i went for i think realistically a barbo would be the biggest goal scorer for this team but with the market crash at the moment the fact that you know falcao is a 90 rated player and uh, I just had to buy him. Of course, Falcao being a 90 rated player though, has some crazy in-game stats such as 94 finishing and 90 shot power. And he also has 93 jumping and 95 heading accuracy, which is why on his card, he has 89 heading overall. Now, paired with Martinez, this team is definitely one you want to start crossing in with. Um, you know, if you're losing a game and you've been not playing sweaty and then you're like, you know what, we're going to get a goal back here. We're going to cross it into Martinez. We're going to cross it into Falcao. That's exactly what you use this team for. So it's sweaty but you can also use it as a nice fun team as well so guys this is the end of the squad building part i have some goals to show you still so make sure you don't leave but the overall verdict of this team is absolutely amazing as i said if i was going to make it even better i would add in a barbo instead of falcao but i'll leave that down to you guys the overall cost currently is about 600,000 coins but give it one or two weeks and this team will be about 500,000 coins. So that's probably what my title will be, 500,000 coins. Um, but if you enjoyed this squad builder, guys, make sure you do subscribe to me, Ezekiel Gaming HD, for more beast squad builders just like this with team of the season players and stuff like that. I also hit that like button as well if you did enjoy the video and you think it's worthy of a like. If we can smash 500 likes on this video, I'll make sure I get another team of the season squad out for you guys tomorrow morning.
Yeah.